है माई डैड इफ नॉट लविंग मी आई थिंक आई एम एन अनवॉन्टेड चाइल्ड ही लव माई फिफ्थ मोर देन मी द चाइल्ड इन फ्रंट ऑफ मी इफ लिटरली वेपिंग टीयर्स इन हिस्स आइफ रोल्ड आउट मोस्ट ऑफ द चिल्ड्रन हैव दिस फीलिंग वेन दे हैव ए सिबलिंग एंड वेन दे रियलाइज my parents love either it's dad or mom who loves my sibling more than me when a child says mama you don't love me you love my sister more than me when a child says like this to the mom it's a heartbreaking statement for the parents but at the same time it's a painful reality for the child No parent deliberately do this but at times some of the parents give more love and affection for one of the children than the other but most of the parents they really want to love both equally i know there is no ideal parent that means a parent who act always perfectly it's not possible because we are all human beings we cannot act ideally always so what can be done yeah i am coming to that or i would like to have a series of episodes for this topic parenting see if when a child gets a feeling that i am unwanted my sibling is getting more affection more consideration they inculcate a feeling inside that i am unwanted this in the later life takes two parts either an aggression or a withdrawal aggression means they start quarreling wherever they go they think when i raise my voice and i start making noise and i start quarreling i'll get my attention that's the way they used to get their attention during childhood days or they withdraw withdrawal means they will not involve any social activity or the level of activity or the level of actions involved in the social activities will come down both aggression and withdrawal are bad it's not socially good but as i told you earlier no parents are inculcating such feelings intentionally but it happens several times for example the elder one is the younger one is the when the younger one sits on the lap of mom the elder one is looking that and when the elder one gets a chance he goes to mom's lap by seeing this the younger one will say hey, hey, hey mom, mom is mine i want to sit on the lap of my mom when the younger one starts crying on that most of the time mom will say to the elder hey you are elder this is younger one let me take if such a thing happens the elder one will get a feeling that i am not that much important and once the younger one when started crying she gets what she wants it will become a lesson for her that by crying in front of mom i get what i want actually parents are not doing this deliberately this is one of the simple incidents i mentioned there were a lot of incidents in similar fashion so what can be done yeah that's more important what can be done so for example if you get a delicious specially made cake and you have two children what will you do you divide them equally right okay If you have 15 million with you and you want to give to your children two children what will you do 25 25 equally can you divide your love like that if it is a tangible thing like a cake or money you can divide equally but love is something intangible 
don't try to divide love don't try to love equally each children i repeat it is not equal love you are not going to divide your love among children you can love each child to the fullest what i suggest is love them uniquely tell your child i love you the way you are you are different from others in many respect and i love you the child will get a feeling that to get the love of parents mom or dad i need not be another person my parents love the way i am so that is something called unique you don't compare don't say your sister is better than you she is scoring good marks don't you see that please don't make such comments all such comments are giving lot of pain and that will create intelligible marks on their mind that will create lot of emotional wounds and such emotional wounds will have long standing association in their entire adult life so be careful on that as i mentioned earlier there is no ideal parent love them uniquely yeah love them uniquely love them uniquely not equally uniquely means i love you the way you are because you are different from others in many respect i can appreciate that and i love you you need not change you need not copy your brother you need not copy your sister love them uniquely if you have any doubt or if you want a point to discuss please type in the comment box i will give my reply and we can discuss and if you have any queries you type in the comment box if it trigger an elaborate discussion i will come with another episode to deal that so what will you do love them uniquely yes love them uniquely goodbye have a good day